So this is a short message from me, David Llewellyn, the Police and Crime Commissioner for the David Powys Police Force area. And this message is a specific message to Dementia Matters Powys and um, to wish you good luck with the Winter Games activity that you're going to be uh, undertaking. Um, but just before that, I just want to reflect on the participatory budgeting event that was held and how fantastic it was for me to be able to invest £10,000 per neighbour policing team area in the Devil Powys area. So that was 140,000. And of course you were successful in getting money so that you could uh, buy equipment and provide opportunities to um, really tackle issues in relation to dementia and isolation within our community. So I'm really grateful for the work that you do. Uh, thank you also to uh, Sergeant Jenna Jones that's involved in this. And I wish you all the best with uh, the Winter Games. And I hope uh, in time I can come up and, and visit yourselves in Powys as well. Thank you very much. Diolch. Mum chose painting by numbers. She did all the white on the outside of this one. And I chose this painting by numbers. That was quite a challenge. I've always been quite crafty and enjoyed making things, but I've never tried embroidery before. When Dementia Matters in Paris announced the Winter Games with a chance to try embroidery, I jumped at that opportunity. This is what I made. Woodwork was another option. I chose a dragon.
Well, I, I didn't have any intentions. I didn't ask for that one for the reason of doing that, of sending it to her. But as I was doing it, I was like thinking, oh, what am I going to do with this? And I suppose I'll frame it and hang it on the wall. And then as I got towards the end and it was coming up to his, his anniversary is next week. And, um, and then I thought, oh, actually, I might send it to my sister-in-law. And then the more I thought about it, then I thought, well, it's perfect because he had dementia, my brother and um alzheimer's and dementia and and it's the you know it's the colors of the alzheimer and dementia groups and and i thought it'll be it'll be perfect to send to her and yeah and she has a lovely um photograph on the wall of our david um it was actually one that i had printed for her that she had on the coffin because obviously nobody was allowed to see him um because of covid and um, so what the undertakers have suggested now for, of, for this is that you have a photograph of the person on the coffin. So people, because people haven't been able to see each other, it just reminds you of them. And it was a lovely photograph that Layla actually took of my, my brother. And um, so I had that frame for her and she, you know, I gave it to her after the funeral. And we've all, all of us, the, the three, but the siblings, me, me and my other brother got a copy and I had them done for my nieces as well for their, because of their dad. And she's got that up on our bedroom wall, so I'm hoping that she may put this next to it so it'll be, you know, together. <laughs>